fun. Well, I was gonna level up and stuff, but there's some other junk that needs to be done. So why not? I just figured I would start streaming anyway. I think because there's like strength and then there's like surf. There's the guy with surf. Oh, he's up there. He's up there. That's the guy with strength. And I can't get strength anyway. I want to like do everything on, I guess, the ring just to show what I'm doing. Shall we introduce beer of the day? Grolsch. One of, uh, one of my favorites. Gold teeth thrust upon you. Ew. You could have at least sold those for some money. Now we'll just go get strength. It's so easy when you're not dealing with a safari zone, just to like, get the HMs or whatever. If you can still call them that, the hidden moves, whatever. It's just like such an easy drink. This is where we're going to be catching a lot of our Pokemon. We can catch a lot of our Pokemon here. We'll probably even just skip on past the Cinnabar. Even if we don't uh, fight anybody, just to uh, catch Pokemon. Skip on down to Cinnabar. Catch all the, like, Grimer and junk like that. We can also go up to the power plant. If we need to get some extra Pokemon, we can go up there too. There's like a number of places that we can kind of do some stuff at, at this point. Once you get Surf, catching the rest of these Pokemon should be pretty easy. I think I got like 15 Pokemon to catch. Not too many. And once I catch all of these, there's not... Honestly, we could, we could probably just do this thing with Cinnabon real quick. Because if we do it now, then we don't have to do it later. Then it's just a matter of like fighting the gym leaders and going to Victory Road. There's really not too much left to explore. It's really just the end. End game. Any Pokemon, thank you. I gotta have like I got this mental checklist in my head of uh, games that I started and haven't finished and I just I need to finish them so that's a problem this being one of them you don't tell me anyway. Highland Brewing hmm. shall we read let's see Smooth with hints of chocolate and freshly roasted coffee. Alright, so good news here. Now we can just go straight in here. Get the card key and we can start wrapping up. Oh. 51? I've already got 51. Okay, sweet. I had no idea I already caught so many. If you are able to laugh at yourself, other people are probably going to laugh too. So if you feel good about watching yourself, I mean, that says a lot, right? So that's kind of where I'm at. And that's kind of what I want to do with streaming right now. Um, I want to enjoy this. I want to enjoy this 
So I want to get past this game and I want to do a little something different. Because I didn't want to play this game. Uh, which is no fault of my own. But I want to finish the game. But... I don't want to get that because that's, like that's a rare candy, isn't it? Or in this room, it is, isn't it? Yeah, good thing, good thing. All right, all right, all right. But if I kind of play like a game that I'm interested in, and somehow I'm able to like, kind of make people laugh and stuff too while streaming and do that, that would be huge to me. That would give me such a confidence boost. But right now I'm having a difficult time with it. Because I'm just trying to wrap this up, unfortunately. And that's pretty disappointing to me. Oh, but we're getting there. Soon I'll have like so much more to do. Because I really want to um, set all that up too. I'm gonna have so much to do. It's, it'll be good. It'll be good. What? Why is this guy shiny? <laughs> Wait a second. Full odds? What is full odds in this game? I don't even know. Okay. <laughs> so glad I spotted him. You know the crazy thing is that in this game, right? Dude, in this game, with shiny Pokemon? Like, dude, he's level 44? Hell yeah, I'll use him. Let's go. Wait a second, let's do this. There we go. Level 44. Like, in this game, though, like... Um, one of the brilliant things that I wish that they would keep doing is in this game and like Arceus and stuff, it's just keeping the Pokemon up, like in the overworld, shiny. How you can just easily spot them and you can tell that they're shiny immediately and then you just continue on. But like, for instance, um, I don't even think Scarlet and Violet does that, do they? I feel like, actually, I don't, I don't, I don't know. Scarlet and Violet, I think, might. Sword and Shield did not. You had to, like, enter the fight. Like, you can even see Pokemon above, um, what do you call it, like, in the overworld. But you can't tell that they're shiny, and I hate that. Legends Arceus, not only could you tell that they were shiny, the Scarlet and Violet does it for sure, because I got a, a shiny, um, hop head. I got a shiny hop head. But what I mean is, like, in my Sword and Shield, you couldn't, like, you had to go into battle. What I hate is that you can't tell if it's shiny, even though there are above ground sprites. Not only that, in Scarlet and Violet, there wasn't any audio cues. That I despise. Because Legends Arceus, if there's a shiny Pokemon on the screen, you knew it, right? Like it would make the glitter noise, you knew it. That I miss. That was perfect. Because when you 
Did I not kill? I freaking healed, man. Like when you get the audio cue and you know that there's something shiny nearby, even though you didn't see it, it's so helpful. But in Scarlet and Violet, when there's not even an audio cue and you have no idea, that's difficult and disappointing. Because there could be, and you just don't know. I don't like that. I don't like that. What's the the drop down? Is was it here? Where's it at? Is it on the side? Yeah, 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 yeah. That dude doesn't even say anything. He just says it. It's like how you exit or whatever. We were actually. I mean, we're doing pretty good right now. I think we're doing pretty good. Got shiny Raticate. Could have made sure that Onyx learned Earthquake. I didn't let him. He'd probably help with Blaine here. <laughs> I let him. That's fine. I like the Raticate's color, it's kind of nice. A little Auburn. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. Hello. Hello, Tufoho. Tufoho. We're gonna go fight Kogo. And if we're not level 45 before the end of the gym, I'll just use some rare candies. We'll go fight Sabrina. Then we'll come back fight uh, Blaine. I might be doing this a lot quicker than I thought I was. I thought I wasn't going to do this until uh, tonight. I actually might be wrapping this up pretty quick. I'm kind of excited now. Alright, and real quick, before we start on this gym, Over here. Don't need to fight you. I do need to fight you, I'm pretty sure. I'm gonna go get another beer. And I'll be right back. For our third and Probably last beer as of right now. Oh. Probably last one. Probably. Um, let's see how fast we can kill this guy. It's probably gonna take more than that. Wait, that gives me light screen? What? I thought that that lowered their special attack. But that's busted. What the hell? I thought that that lowered their special attack anyway. Um, last beer of the day. For now. Filler high life. And I have to say, one thing about Miller High Life, and there's such a problem with this. It looks cute though. There's not much taste and it smells like piss. Yeah, no, that's about it. Not much taste and it smells like piss. <laughs> that being said, just because it doesn't have much taste, it, I mean, it's actually not 
too hard to drink because it doesn't have much taste. So it actually doesn't have like a like a bad aftertaste or anything either. So it's it's not horrible. It's actually not horrible. some other ones in there that I'm like super dying to try. There's ones called uh, Dragon Milk. I don't know if you've ever heard of it. Dragon Milk looks flipping fire. And I think it's like 11% or something. 12%. Like pretty hot. For a beer. It looks so good. Can't wait to try that. See how that one is. There's also another that I have in there that I think is like pretty high too, 13, 14 percent or something. Crazy thing too is like there's not very many places around here that like you can actually go and get like a decent drink, much less like a. That is one of my least favorite things in this entire game. Why did they even do that? What? They like allow you to use a revive on a Pokemon that's alive and then it wastes your turn. In the old games you used to say like, oh you just can't do that. They allow you to use it. How the hell? Wait, what? Whatever, I, I'm just gonna go heal real quick. I hate that they allow you to do that. That's so stupid. That's crazy stupid. But we got a shiny uh, Raticate. That's pretty cool. One of the least favorite. Come on, that part. He's not. He's not that special. I like his burgundy though. He looks cool. Oh, can you just teach him one right here? Hell yeah, brother. Oh, wait a second. I really don't want to take away that though. If we if we have um psychic fighting dragon see the thing is is that that has like what does this do? Stat changes among all Pokemon, that's gonna be so bad. Because I'm going to be making stat changes. This is the fairy type move, right? This also heals all status conditions. What's Betty Bad do? Physical moves. This is reflect, but it's a special type attack. Now I'm starting to because they're all special attacking, dude. Don't want to get rid of those. The burn, honestly, 
probably going to be better than Reflect. I feel like. Maybe not. I mean, maybe not. Where the hell am I going? Okay, then I fought that guy. Right here, there we go, there we go, there we go. I don't think if, if any of that is worthwhile, because double edge is probably the best move, right? He's like 180 with the normal type. Plus it's physical, that's the thing. It's probably the only physical type move I have besides sizzling the slide or whatever. So I don't know if I want to give either of those up. I don't think I'm going to. I think that this will work out. Though, with how much everybody likes the Toxic, that Fairy type move is not looking so bad. I forgot that this game can just randomly appear, you know, maybe it doesn't even flip the matter. the light screen now. Dude, that's so broken. These moves are crazy. I, I actually kind of enjoy that. The thing that I don't like, though, is that because these moves are so crazy, is that your starter, like your Pikachu or your Eevee from these games, you can't evolve. They make them specific because they got all the hair styles and clothing, junk, and whatever too, so you can't evolve them, which is stupid. Kinda of don't like that. So now I've got a light screen up, like if I can just paralyze him and see if I can get anything out of him. Like get him to paralyze himself so I can get more attacks off of him. And my Eevee's probably gonna heal itself soon. Possibly. And just use double edge. Until my light screen wears off. And there's the poison gone. It's so like that's crazy, bro. That's not bad at all. It's pretty good. I could kill him here, but I think... Oh, well that's a bit of a difference though. I don't think that... I feel like he's gonna use Protect though. Then I can just light screen again. No, he's paralyzed. I'll get red, whatever. Like, if you're just using the starters, this game pretty great. Like, well, great, but like easy. Because they just learn the best moves. Insane moves that they learn. I guess that's again because like this is also from like Pokemon Go trying to get people into like the actual Pokemon game like franchise. So they have to make it as easy as possible. Which makes sense. That's fair. I just need to take him down here. And then hopefully I'll heal the poison. If not, I'll have to use a hyper potion. 
do we already did Cinnabar Island? Like the only thing that we got left to do is go fight Sabrina and Blaine and then just Giovanni. We're like so close to being done actually. Because then it's just Victory Road. I feel like I, I, I could probably finish this tonight. I could finish this tonight. As soon as I get back and I like stream again, I'll probably finish this tonight. That's kind of exciting. So I'm very excited to get back on like other schedules and like do something else. I'm actually super excited. I'm dead to poison. I didn't heal, okay. I thought he was gonna heal himself. That's fun though. You know what this reminds me of? My my friend who loves Corona. This kind of reminds me of Corona. It's just like I don't really taste any flavor in Corona. Like there's hardly any flavor. And this just tastes like so flavorless. Like this is so it's just a nothing burger, man. There's just nothing to do with it. That reminds me of Corona. Which again, in its own right, not bad. Not bad. If you don't want to taste beer, get one of these. As long as you don't have a problem with your beer smelling like this. You have a problem with it smelling like I guess you you got like other issues. Just don't get these. He's probably gonna die to fly, I imagine. I'm just gonna go ahead and revive. You know, one of the games that I missed from my childhood. Oh, dude, that reminds me. Dude, that would be so sick. So, like, one of the things I want to do, right? I need, like, I need to put new batteries on my cartridges, though. Because those are so old, the batteries are dead. I want to, like, I have Pokemon Stadium, and I can stream it. I'm like, I want to stream everything that I have from consoles. I've said that before. Like, I don't want to do um, emulator kind of junk. I, I, I don't want to do that. But the cool thing is, is that from console is um, Super 64, then the Nintendo 64. I have all of like Pokemon Crystal Gold, Silver, and Junk. I have all of those. I need Pokemon Red. I don't have Pokemon Red. It's the only one I'm missing from like back then. I'm missing a couple others. I'm missing further ahead. I'm missing Red, then I'm missing Ruby, Pearl. I'm missing Pokemon Black, White 2. And then I'm missing... I don't... Am I missing anything? Oh, Soul Silver. I'm missing Soul Silver. I want to get... I want to get those, but my point is... Is with Pokemon Crystal and stuff... Is if I replace the battery, I make it good... I can play Crystal on the um, the emulator that they have on Stadium. I can like plug it in, play it, and I can even speed it up and stuff if I wanted to. Because you can have like times two times three on that one. I can even speed it up if I want to. And then I can use those same Pokemon 
play stadium. Dude, that would be so sick. Like on the actual cartridge to do that. I feel like that that'd be so cool. I really want to do that. And that's why I like streaming from the actual hardware and stuff. I freaking love that. There's so much stuff that I want to do, but I want to make it like so, I want to make it so good. I want to make it good and I don't want to, I don't want to like disappoint. I get, I get, I got stuff to work on. <sighs> All right. I think Kit's probably about to wake up soon, so I might be ending stream soon. Let's see how far we can get in Sabrina's gym real quick. 